I'm gonna show you guys my rear facing gimbal camera. Got the Fiutech gimbal and the night ride connected to it. So now as I'm walking, everything behind me is recorded and it's also stabilized. And then the night ride <clears throat> is connected to my phone. Um, and I can see everything behind me. Now I can use a secondary app on my regular cell phone to control the gimbal itself. So I can look and say, all right, well, it's not quite center or it's too high. I can adjust the gimbal. And I'm gonna show you exactly how I've got this set up. So, obviously I've got it in my pack. I've got the battery pack here. Got the cable ran through. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and turn this off so I can take it apart and show you guys what's going on. So we'll disconnect here. Now I have rigged a lot of this because there's no real there's stuff you can buy, but um, why buy it when you can kind of make it? You definitely don't want to have your cord hanging all over the place. This isn't something you're going to want to wear um, when you're going into thick brush, obviously. Um, but I have. Actually, I've done the same setup with my camera before. Basically, what I've done is pull out of here. And you can use different things yourself to accomplish this. but there is 3D printer plastic that you can buy. Comes in beads. You can put it in hot water and melt it. Um, that's all I did was make a stand for it. That way, when it sits in the bag, this kind of, it holds the base of the unit in one spot. And then you can use a towel or a pillows or whatever you want to do. Um, I use this obviously to wrap it around to keep it from moving around in the bag. And you also want to make sure that when it is in the bag, um, it's got a natural tendency to lean back towards the back, which is actually pretty good because you want to watch all the, the zippers and straps, everything else. You don't want it hitting this con control screen or anything like that. But the goal is basically just to have it sitting in that bag just like this and stay still inside of that bag. When you move around, it doesn't flop back and forth, left to right, all that stuff. This is just a prototype. I just threw it together. It's not pretty, but it definitely works. Um, I've actually got another piece for the top. Um, I didn't need to use it because the bag I'm using is smaller, so it keeps everything tighter. But that's pretty much the setup. Very basic, but uh, it definitely works. Um, you notice a big difference when the image is stabilized. You know, I don't have to put it in another program to stabilize it in a program, um, or not as much, but uh, that's pretty much it.